Okay, in this video, uh, we're going to do an update to uh, TouchWiz for the Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.1. Um, the only problem I had was logging into my uh, Samsung account. What I had to do was create another I had to create another account using a different domain or a different um, email account. So instead of Google, I used um, uh, Live, which is uh, MSN or Microsoft. Okay, uh, you about to see the video on how to run this update. Mine ran okay and I have no issues to report. Enjoy. Okay, I'm doing a TouchWiz update on the Samsung Galaxy Tab 10.1. First, I'm going to remove all the widgets and icons off the home screen. Okay, you now you don't have to remove all your widgets and apps. I just do that just to be on the safe side. You know, I, for example, I have this Evernote app. Uh, there might be a link in there, linking to my one of my contacts or Pulse. So, just to be on the safe side, I remove each and every item off my home screen. Okay, let's continue with the update. Okay, you hit apps, settings, and on the bottom here we go to about tablet, system updates, and update. And here it tells you where you need to remove your widgets that's linking to your contacts or pulse, the pulse app. Okay, let's hit, let's hit download. And it's downloading. Okay, now it says the software updated. Download is completed. Now we're going to hit install. Okay, uh, now it's asking us to reboot and it's doing just that. Okay, when it reboots, you, know, you see a progression bar on the bottom and uh, the percentage count. Okay, we're at 
and a hundred. Okay, it's applying the update. And this is the first re reboot after the update. Okay, it is successfully rebooted. All right, and that's a and that's a successful update. Okay, the first thing I couldn't re re recognize is the numbering on the top. I guess based on what desktop you're on. There is some changes with the icons on the left here and that is the TouchWiz Samsung Promise Desk with Task manage Manager, Calendar, World Clock, a Pen Memo, Calculator, and a Music Player. Okay, that's an icon to capture a screen. That's the multitask, home and back. Okay, let's take a quick look at some of the widgets. Uh, we have AccuWeather, Agenda. There's an App Mobile, AP Mobile widget. There's a bookmark widget. And we have one for a digital clock. Dual clock. Email. There's one for gallery. Okay, for the gallery, make sure you select the pictures you want to display and hit OK. There's a program monitor widget, 
social hub in Yahoo Finance. And I will go into de more details in my future videos.